The IRS is especially targeting those mostly at risk, such as the elderly, children under five, and pregnant women. In 2017, 43,000 malaria cases were reported in Namibia, compared to 24,000 in 2016. So it's the launch of the indoor residual spray for malaria, for preventing the mosquitoes that are hiding in these structures uh, from continue hiding. As we know, the rainy season is coming and these mosquitoes are the ones who will continue to breed and cause or carry the, the parasite. Too. So what we're doing is that basically every structure in this region that is prone to malaria infection should be sprayed, actually. That, that will help us a lot. This year's campaign targets eight regions, namely the Kavango East and West, Oshana, Oshikoto, Kunene, Oshizonjupa, Omaheke, Ohangwena and Omasati regions. Spray teams will visit homes with the minister assuring residents that the WHO approved spray is safe for use. We know that it does have a side effect if used wrongly and that's why my instructor was telling me not to go back when I'm spraying, I must only spray one way forward. Because if you go back then you double the dose of the spray and you can cause imbalance or toxicity of the chemical. But otherwise it's safe, relatively speaking. Um, it's been approved um, in our situation by WHO. Community members have been encouraged to welcome the spray teams to ensure maximum coverage. The ministry says it has been working around the clock to sensitize the community. We engaged the traditional leaders and the opinion leaders in the community. Our teams are going from village to village, from constituency to constituency to mobilize people so that we'll avoid that scenario. In the event that uh, there, there are people for one reason or the other who are missed out. The IRS is done free of charge in all malaria prone regions and residents are encouraged to take out furniture, food, water and clothes before the spraying exercise and wait for at least two hours before reoccupying the rooms. Gordon Joseph, NBC News, Kurenkuru.